As an angler who's passionate about exploring that next destination, chasing that next species, it's impossible for one fish to stop interrupting that train of thought, steelhead. My buddy Derek Litzinger and I spent all our high school weekends running off from our parents and sports practices to go camp in the back of the truck, chasing trout and steelhead anywhere that sounded appetizing. We love to explore. Back in November of 2022, I had an idea brewing in my head to gift my buddy Derek something special. On Christmas morning, he opened an envelope with two Delta flight ticket receipts, making him well aware that we were indeed going on a steel adventure just like back in the teenage days. Steelhead are a fish that Joseph and I have been chasing together for a long time. I was so stoked for us to hit the road together again. After a long drive, we made it to our Airbnb for the week. We hit a local fly shop and spent an evening driving the local back roads and highways in search of local swing water as we only had the afternoon to fish on day one. Oh yeah, and Joe put his jar in a tree. That's a trout of some sort, very small. <laughs> very, very small. 
pecking at it. But we got him. Wow. Trophy. A true trophy. See you, bud. Each day passed and we tried a different river, purchased a different license, floated a different section in the drift boat, and still no steelhead after four long days, sun up to sundown, swinging flies. It truthfully took those first four days to grind, learn, and get our asses handed to us because on the fifth day, we had a spot in mind that we knew we could time right with the tide. That morning of the fifth day, I woke up telling Derek, first blood is today. I just knew at the moment my eyes opened and my head left the pillow. Steelhead fishing is a mind game, full of maintaining confidence and perseverance throughout the day. You're kidding. You're kidding. You're kidding. On the strip up. Oh my god. Looks like a big steel head. I don't even think this fish has woke up yet. This fish hasn't even woke up. Dude? No way. It's big, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. But... Oh! <laughs> he hasn't woken up yet, dude. I'm telling you. Oh my god. This fish is huge. <laughs> dude. dude, I think he just woke up. Uh oh. He had his. You got your camera? Uh, it's in my car, but it's all good. We'll get it. We'll get it. I think he just woke up. <laughs> oh this God. fish hasn't woken up yet. Okay. <laughs> just tail him. Oh. oh, he did it! Nice! Oh. My God, dude. <gasps> <gasps> what do you have to say? That is first coastal steelhead. Wow. We're like a mile from the ocean. We are very, very close to the ocean. Oh my goodness. I think we're gonna send her home. Get out there. Wow. That is insane. All right, back to the same spot. Dude, that's the fish of a lifetime. <laughs> Just shook hands with it. 
That was, was insane, dude. We had the mentality to go for all the marbles as we'd spent every day of the trip playing it safe, fishing all the most typical steelhead zones recommended by locals. We drove the longest we had from home base on day seven to a smaller system that flowed directly into the bay, not a tributary, just straight fresh to salt. The levels were just right. A good bit of rain came in the night before. I was swinging a fast head of the run just downstream of Derek. In my right ear, I heard a very strange holler in the distance. I looked upstream and couldn't see Derek. Seconds later, I heard a more distinct holler. Fish! <laughs> No way! No way! No way! Oh. No way! No way! Yo! Derek! 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 Dude, you got this! 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 Dude, it's a big colored up bug. I'm shaking right now. Yeah, dude. But you can't let him get in the tail out either. So you Dude, just he's about to jump again. Keep good pressure. He's about to jump again. He's running at me. Keep good pressure. He's about to jump. Three. Keep good pressure. Two. Keep good pressure. Come on, baby. Dude, Let's dude, go. dude. Let's freaking go. Let's go. I just had go. a weird feeling I heard you yelp. I was yelling at the top of my lungs. Oh. Eight on the strip? Dude, I can't, I cannot believe how big this thing is. Yeah. It right, came dude. out of the hole and just yelp. Took it. Oh, I saw it. Dude, that's like a 38. No joke. Dude, it's giant, Derek. You got this. Walk him to the left. He's about to jump. Oh! Oh! Dude, this is what we came to BC for. This is what we came to BC for. BC, baby. Oh, oh my god. Let him run, let him run. There you go. Oh! Dude! Oh! Oh! We'll take where we can beach him up a little bit and tail him. But he's not gonna come in easy. He might just keep good. Just keep good pressure. Don't good. go in the boulder. Good job. Look how big he is. So you're shaking Dude. so bad. You're I know. You're shaking so bad. I know. We worked so hard for this fish. Oh my god. There. Almost there, bro. Almost there. Oh. Feels so good on this rock. Yep. Take that first run. Yep. There you go, play the opposite, it's good. Dude. You're gonna freak out. Derek, whatever happens from here, we did it. You're gonna freak out when you see this fish. Whatever happens from here, we did it. Whatever happens from here, we did it. We did it. This is, right now is what it's about. The fish is the cherry on top. I promise you, I'm gonna do my absolute best. I got him! I got him! Let's go! Let's go! Good job, Bob! Good job! That is a beast. Thank you so much, buddy. Go make some babies. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh! Whoa! Oh, I'm so... Oh my god! 
We just did 24 it. 24 hour drive. We just did it. Six days right without there. a fish. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. I literally prayed for this moment today. I was, I was literally, you can't, I can't think of the word right now. I'm trying to think. <laughs> Not fantasizing, because that would be weird, <laughs> but kind of fantasizing, like getting the picture in my head, giant buck, I want a big caught up buck today. And just magically the fish gods were like, you know what? Here it is. 2,000 casts, we'll, we'll give it to you. <laughs> Let's freaking go. Dude! Let's yes! <laughs> so the last six days, we've been fishing relentlessly. Joseph, the day he caught his fish, he was like, first blood, today's gonna happen. A day passes, and I'm like, okay, maybe this theory kind of <laughs> caught on to me. So I woke up this morning, and I was like, dude, I'm getting one today. I was manifesting it in my head. I was like, big colored up buck, we're gonna find one, and I'm gonna catch it. And here we are stripping spay flies in super deep frog water holes, and this guy just smokes it. <laughs> and he, just, he was hot. Just jumped. jumping like three, four times. They saw, they saw. <laughs> that was a fish of a lifetime, dude, for sure. <laughs> Golly. Dude, we've been planning this trip since Thanksgiving time, except he didn't know until Christmas day, he opened an envelope and it was a plane ticket to Idaho. We drove two days worth to Canada and wanted to chase steelhead in one of the best places for him in the world, so. Six days of hard work and well-earned fish. Only two fish. That's Only what it's all about. That's what, that's what makes steel hiding, steel hiding. <laughs> Thousands of dollars. Yep. Thousands of miles hiking, driving, and we did it. <laughs> well, I think we're going to soak it in for a while. Yeah. <laughs> that fish was so special because that morning of that same exact day, I woke up and told Joseph, today I'm going to catch a colored up buck because I've never caught a huge colored up buck in my life steelhead fishing before. And I knew that we were in a special enough place to do it and that we had the right equipment, the right knowledge, and that we were gonna get it done. When I shook hands with that fish, I couldn't think of anything else besides that we had accomplished our mission, bless all together to be there and experience that with my best friend. Steelhead are not a fish that you go into a trip expecting to catch. They're a trip that you have to know you aren't gonna catch. And when you do, it will forever remain your heart. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And get in the car, grab your best buddy, do something special together because you only live once. We'll see you in the next video. Peace.